Hello, good morning children. Are you okay? Are you all safe? Good. So yesterday we learned about, what did we learn about? The rain. Where does the rain come from? Yes, it falls from the sky. How does it fall? Pitter patter. It makes a kind of sound. Pitter patter, pitter patter. Isn't it? Yes. So you made that noise with your fingers? Alright. So we just go through once again. Oh, where do you come from? That's the first line. Second line. And I told you, when you write poem, it begins with a capital letter. Every line begins with a capital letter. And it's got a method. The first line should not be written with the second line. If you can't write the first line in your book or wherever you write and you need space, you write it in the next line. But the second line should not be followed with the first line. And the second line should be written in the below line. Okay. So just keep in mind, in any class it is, that's the rule. All right. Oh, where do you come from? You little raindrop. Is it you little raindrop? You little drops of rain. What is it? You little drops of rain. Pitter patter, pitter patter. That's how the rain keeps falling. The sound when it makes, it falls on the ground. It makes pitter patter sound. Down the window pane. I told you what is window pane. Yes, the glass part of the window is called the window pane. They won't let me walk. When it rain, won't allow you to walk. And they won't let me play. Won't allow you to play. And they won't let me go. That means to come out even from the door. Out of doors at all today. You have to be all day long inside the house. Got no chance of getting out of the house. The reason is, it is raining. And how it is raining? Pitter patter. And where the... Uh, rain water is falling on the window pane. Yes. When it falls on the window pane, it's making that sound. So, let's come to the next lines. Keep your book open. Page number 22. They put away all my playthings. That means all the toys they'll take in, keep away. Because I broke them all. The reason that you're destroying, you're breaking them all. Break. Playthings. Playthings means your toys. They put away my play things. What is it? Play things. Let's write that word on the board. Play and things both together. It's a compound word. Play things. P L A Y T H I N G S. Play things. Play things. Both word together joined. That is called the compound word. They put away my play things. What they put away? They put away my Play things, P L A Y T H I N G S. Play things away, E W A Y S away, E W A Y S away. Now, because I broke them all, it's a past tense here. Break is present tense. Broke, break past tense is broke. I just write it down. Break, B R E A K, break. The past tense is broke. B R O K E broke. Break past tense broke. So because how do you spell because? B E C A U S C. B E C A U S E is because. B E C A U S C because. So because I broke them all. It already yes destroyed everything. And then they locked up all my bricks. See, this is all the building blocks. So they have different kinds of building blocks. What did they do? They put away, put away means kept away all the building blocks. They put away all the bricks. Bricks means all the blocks. Locked. Locked means, yes, you won't be able to take it back after that. It is closed with lock and key. Locked. L-O-C-K-E-D. Locked. Lock past tense is locked. Lock past tense is locked. Bricks. How do you spell bricks? B R I C K S. Bricks. B R I C K S. Bricks. B R I C K S. Bricks. So read that four lines again. They put away my playthings because I broke them all. They put away my playthings because I broke them all. And then and then they locked up 
all my bricks and took away my ball so took away everything nothing there to play with all the toys the ball everything has been taken and kept away and it is locked the reason is because he is breaking everything is breaking and destroying everything that is why they put away all the play things and also it is raining outside so he cannot go outside they say i'm very naughty and what did they tell him yes they said is very naughty is a bad boy is doing all the bad things naughty n a u g h t y naughty naughty means not listening to your parents or not doing the right thing so then you become naughty n a u g h t y naughty but i have now i have it's written here i and apostrophe apostrophe v e that means i have but when you read i have i have nothing else to do but sit here and sit here at the window i should like to play with you play with who yes play, play with the rain now the little fellow is saying that i got nothing else to do just sit here and then look outside but he says i like to play with you with whom with the yes with the rain then then say i am very naughty then say what i am very naughty but i have nothing else to do nothing else means nothing to do simply sit down wasting time nothing how do you spell nothing n o t h i n g nothing n o t h i n g is nothing nothing means nothing means no no work nothing no what should i say nothing means there is no other way for you to do anything simply sitting and wasting your time nothing to do okay now but sit here at the window i should like to play with you now this is what the author is saying i want to play with you but i cannot do it all the toys are put away and lock the toys and cannot do anything and just only sit at the window and look outside see the rain and he is also saying that you would like to like to play with you okay once again we'll read the portion which you took today they put away my play things because i broke them all and they locked up all my bricks and took away my ball he had one ball that also they were taken away and all that they did and after that what did they say they say i'm very naughty they also said he is very naughty but i have nothing else to do nothing else to do means is no things can be done but sit here at the window i should like to play with you just learn this okay and sing this and learn these spellings shall we repeat it p l a y t h i n g s play things a w a y away n a u g h t y naughty n o t h i n g nothing b r e a k break past tense is broke break broke is the past tense and present tense this is break is present tense broke past tense b e c a u s e because l o c k e d locked b r i c k s bricks bricks means a rectangular piece of solid stone is known as brick so please learn the poem read how many times as possible for you okay and learn that it's very interesting poem so please learn that okay and write these words in your rough notebook so see you bye